So if you've never tried Book Creator before, it's a fantastic resource that will allow your students to create their own interactive books. And really, it's more than just an interactive book. If you go to the website, bookcreator.com, you can see some of the examples on the screen, interactive stories, digital portfolios, research journals, lots of different projects that you can create with Book Creator. So in some of my other videos, I'm going to show you how you and your students can actually create books using this platform. But this video will show you how to get started with using Book Creator. Okay, so step one, if you want to create your own account in Book Creator, just go to bookcreator.com and click on the button that says create a free account. From there, make sure that you're signed in as a teacher and not a student. By default, the student login comes in, so just switch over to teacher and sign up with one of these three different methods. Perfect, so we're in Book Creator now, and the first thing that we have to do is give a name for our library. I'm just going to call my ninth grade English. And then click the button at the bottom. Okay, so now I'm ready to go to my library. Okay, so you'll notice that it's showing me that there are no books in this library. Now for this particular situation, I want my students to have access to my library so they can create their own books and so that as the teacher I can go in and see their work in progress. So to do that, I have to share the join code with my students and you'll find that right at the top. So this is something where I would share this code either in a learning management system, maybe in front of the room on the board, and students would need to make sure that they have this code written down. Okay, so now for students to join, all that they would have to do is do the same thing. Click on create a free account, and this time sign in as a student with one of the three methods. And then once they sign in, all they'll have to do is click on the three lines at the top and choose join a library. And then this is where they'll copy and paste the code that I shared with them. Okay, so now you can see that this student is in my ninth grade English library. They are ready to create a book and as the teacher, when they create a book, I can see their work in real time. So if you haven't done this yet, go ahead and get started. Sign up for Book Creator at bookcreator.com, see if your students can join your library, and then create their own books.